Hi guys, today we're going to go through the determination of relative atomic masses by the analysis of the data from the mass spectra in terms of isotopic abundance. So here I've got a graph uh, with a percentage of isotope uh, on the y-axis and I've got the mass in atomic mass units on the x-axis. I've got two different isotopes A and B. I've got 60% of A and 40% of B. So how would I work out the average uh, atomic mass of this isotope? Oh, so these isotopes, well I'll do 60 times by the mass of A plus 40 times the mass of B. And all divided by uh, 60 plus 40, which is 100. The element copper has naturally occurring isotopes with mass numbers of 63 and 65. The relative abundance and atomic masses are 69.2% for a mass of 62.93 atomic mass units and 30.8% for a mass of 64.93 atomic mass units. Calculate the average atomic mass of copper. Okay, so we need to do the percentages. So 69.2 times by the masses, times by 62.93. Okay, and then add that to the second one, which was 30.8 uh, times by 64.93. And that gets all divided by... Uh, 100, which gives us a final answer of 63.55 atomic mass units. Calculate the average atomic mass of sulfur if 95% of all sulfur atoms have a mass of 31.972 atomic mass units, 0.76 uh, has a mass of 32.971 atomic mass units and 4.22% have a mass of 33.967 atomic mass units. So unlike the previous question, this time we've got three different isotopes but it really is exactly the same technique. So firstly we're going to do brackets 95 times by uh, 31.972 plus brackets uh, 0 0.76 times by 32.971 and finally uh, 4.22 times by 33.9 uh, oops 967 nine, just about got it in there and then divide the whole lot by 100 we get an answer of 32.057 atomic mass units. Calculate the average atomic mass of bromine. One isotope of bromine has an atomic mass of 78.92 atomic mass units and a relative abundance of 50.69%. And another major isotope of bromine has an atomic mass of 80.92 atomic mass units and a relative abundance of 49.31%. So, firstly we need to multiply the atomic masses with their relative abundances. So, 50.69% uh, times by 78.92 plus uh, the other isotope uh, had an abundance of 49.31% and times that by 80.92 and we're going to divide that all by 100 and we get a final answer of uh, 79.91 atomic mass units bye for now if you like this video don't forget to subscribe and love from me